check out Ocean City right now. Another beautiful looking day. People are out on the boardwalk, but man, if you happen to be running the wrong way into the wind this afternoon, it'll make it very, very difficult for you to get to where you need to go. The winds are still howling. Winds really ramped up through the afternoon hours and are still very strong right now, but it is mild outside. We're up to 67 degrees. Yesterday we were in the low 50s, so today feels completely different outside. It's 66 in Allentown, 67 in Millville and Atlantic City at 68. But you can see those wind barbs accelerating from the west. It is a blustery afternoon. Winds right now gusting to near 40 miles an hour, 39 miles an hour in the city, 35 miles per hour in Allentown, 38 mile per hour winds in Wilmington. We've backed off just slightly. Last hour, Mount Pocono was about 47 miles an hour, so getting slightly better, but still very, very windy through at least eight or nine o'clock. We're in a red flag warning, and you may be wondering, what does that actually mean? It could also be called a high fire danger warning. So when winds get like this, we have very dry vegetation, shrubbery, not a lot of greenery out there, a lot of dry branches. All it takes is a tiny little spark and fires, wildfires could spread very, very rapidly on a day like today. So please be very safe. Keep any burning under control. Never throw a cigarette butt out the car window, especially on a day like today. Again, dry brush gusts to 40 miles an hour and fires again spread very rapidly. That's the reason for our red flag warning. Storm scan three shows uh, dry conditions in place though high pressure building overhead that high will center it over top of us tomorrow and that means tomorrow is another tranquil day it's slightly cooler than today but not as windy but then we're tracking our next system you can see it there back over Nebraska and Iowa it'll bring us some rain through the day on Friday so tonight mainly clear the winds die down will drop down to near 40 for the overnight low tomorrow sunshine giving way to a few high clouds drifting in in the afternoon it's a nice day though mild and pleasant with a high around 61 right on target for the time of year and a wonderful weekend on the way as well. Saturday we hit 70, Sunday 68 degrees. The average is 61. But between tomorrow and the weekend, we've got this day. Friday 49 degrees. It will be mainly cloudy with periods of rain on and off throughout the course of the day. It doesn't look like heavy flooding rain, doesn't look like severe weather, but again, periods of rain and that will keep temperatures only in the 40s but it'll actually make the weekend feel all that much nicer. We'll get through that day. Saturday, we hit 70 for the high. Sunday, 68 degrees for the high. And then showers return to the area Sunday night into Monday, and we may be tracking rain Monday night into Tuesday of next week as well. So the weekend kind of nestled in between two not so nice weather patterns, mm -hmm. but we'll take it. The weekend looks great, and tomorrow looks really nice too. Beautiful. You make that tea time yet? Not yet. You got four of us. Don's you, here. You know, you know I will. You <laughs> I know. know I will. Thanks, Kate.